So in this video, we're going to unbox this uh, that will give a solution if you are uh, running out of space in your iPhone Pro Max or iPhone 13. So if you are still new to my channel, just click the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you will be updated to my upcoming videos. So come and join me as we unbox this Sandis X-Pan Plus Drive Locks. Okay, for today's video, we're going to unbox this uh, Sandis iXpand Plus Drive Locks. This is uh, specifically used for your iPhone, iPad, and anything that has a USB Type-C and Lightning uh, cable. So in this video, we're just going to unbox this uh, Sandis iXpand. So usually, if you use your iPhone for taking pictures and videos, Sometimes uh, you don't have any more space. So just like me, I have uh, 128 gigabytes of my space in my iPhone uh, Pro Max. So now I only have uh, 49, I think 49 gigabytes of uh, free space in my iPhone Pro Max. So I usually use my iPhone Pro Max to uh, take uh, videos uh, using the Filmic Pro. If you have a Filmic Pro, eat a lot of uh, space if you are going to take uh, video, especially if you are going to take like uh, 4K videos in your iPhone. So usually uh, 5 minutes of uh, videos uh, using Filmic Pro, it would take you like uh, almost 1 gig or 3 gig, especially if you are using the higher use resolution of your uh, iPhone uh, video. Okay, so this is the uh, Sandisk iSpan Plus Drive Locks. I got uh, 128 uh, gigabytes, and this is specifically made for iPhone and iPad because uh, iPhone usually have a lightning cable, and then your iPad has a USB Type C uh, cable. So you can also purchase uh, this iSpan with lightning to a USB. If you have a laptop, then you can purchase that. Uh, I expand using the Lightning 2 USB cable, but in my in my in, in my case, I have a MacBook or a, an iPad, so usually this is a USB Type C, and uh, our 13 Max Pro iPhone usually use the I, uh, Lightning cable. Okay, so I'm going to unbox this now. So this is uh, for iPhone, iPad, and USB Type C devices. So it easily moves files between your your iPhone and USB Type C Android devices. It automatically backup your photos and videos. So as you can see, this is a, I purchased this in a Sandisk store. It cost me a, like a, a ninety nine dollars, I think. So. Uh, if you experience any uh, low space in your iPhone, then uh, you need this Sandisk iXpand Plus Drive so that you can free up more space. If you are using your iPhone in taking uh, videos for your YouTube channel or taking for some pictures. Okay, so we're going to unbox this. Uh... Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to unbox this one. Oh, this is good to take out. So I need to cut again. Okay. Okay, so this is the Sunday Sykes one. So it's made of, I think it's made of metal. Yeah, it's made of metal. The, the construction is made of metal with the Sunday's uh, name. So if you are going to take out this, uh, see again. Oh, so this is the lightning uh, cable that will that you're going to put in your iPhone. Then if you're going to twist it, there's another one which is a. Uh, uh, the USB Type-C uh, that uh, you're going to 
put in your uh, MacBook or uh, in your iPad. So the construction is good. If you are going to use this lightning cable, just take out this uh, cover so it will protect your uh, lightning cable from any accidental damage so it will protect that one or if you want to use the USB type C so just open the USB type C or and, and put it in your uh, laptop or your iPad so the construction of this uh, is very small so you can just put in your pocket or you can just uh, this is here uh, it's just like a yeah, I think it's uh, yeah this is the size of this one is uh, too small so you can just uh, put it in your pocket and uh, if you want to free up some space with your iPhone so you can use this one and just plug in the this is the USB type C and then if you want to use once you already back up then you, you just plug this uh, USB type C in your laptop or in your iPad so I will not discuss on how to uh, back, make a backup of this uh, using this SamDesk Expand. I will make a separate video on how we can do the backup and free up some space in your iPhone 13 or iPhone 14. In my case, I have iPhone 13 Pro Max. So I usually use the Filmic Pro in uh, taking a video. So uh, as you can uh, as you can see, Filmic Pro usually eat a lot of. Uh, this is space so I think for uh, 5 minutes or 10 minutes of video it would take you like uh, uh, 2, to, 2 to 3 gigabytes so so I will make a separate video uh, on how we are going to do the backup of uh, using this uh, uh, SanDisk iXpand so so in, in order for you to use this SanDisk uh, iXpand there is a, a there is a I expand drive app that you're going to download first in your iPhone so that uh, you can use this uh, SanDisk I expand. So I'm going to uh, make a separate video on how we can go into and how we are going to back up our photos and videos and free up some space in our iPhone uh, 13 Pro or uh, iPhone 13 Pro Max. So come and join me uh, later in the panel in the next video as we do the uh, backup and uh, transfer of our photos and videos using this uh, Sandis iXpand Plus Drive. Okay, thank you for uh, watching this video and watch us for the upcoming videos as we do the backup of our files using this uh, iXpand Sandis. So thank you for watching this video. If you are still new to my channel, just click the subscribe button and the notification bell. So that you'll be updated on my upcoming videos. Bye bye.